Hi, morning to you lads. My name is Assassin, and we are playing some more of the quarry. Here has Lara. We have Ryan over there. Fucking dick. <laughs> I swear, everyone who just turns tunes into the series are just like, why the hell does he hate Ryan? So much? I just do. He's, he's an asshole. But you know, you gotta do search for secrets. Like this box. Damn, Laura. Your boots are hot as hell. This must be. The forgotten belongings of a quarry miner abandoned in the tunnels. A letter of foreclosure within indicates that this has been down here since 1930. Part of the old working quarry. Makes sense. Okay. Anything over here? Maybe a card? Eh? Eh? Maybe? <laughs> Maybe what? No, you're not a card. Alright, they're mining tools though. These rusty old tools are leftovers from Hackett's industrial heyday. Before the mines for closure. Must have been from the quarry days. No duh. No one's been down here for years. Ryan, if you don't shut the fuck up, I swear to god. <laughs> Not trying to go up there. Oh, uh, but yeah, Ryan, you don't shut up. You're gonna be the next person that. I eat because I'm aware of it. Or I'm turning into a little. Guys, I feel like I wouldn't trust Ryan with a shotgun if it cost me my life. Five seconds later, Ryan, take the shotgun! Did you hear that too? It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. Also, real quickly, before I continue on, um, last, ep last episode, when, uh, Ryan, fucking wait, Jesus. <laughs> last episode when we were playing as Lara, and you know how we had to find the password for the computer, and like, it all glitched out and shit? I looked at the recording, or I looked at the recording back, and if you pause it at the right time, you could actually see her, or like, there's a figure with like, black eyes, and I'm assuming it's her, the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. And I also looked it up on the computer, or the, the computer, I'm such a fucking boomer. I looked it up on YouTube, oh, and... Shit. <laughs> But for some reason, no one else posted it, apparently. No, they can't have done. I don't know if they didn't really... This place is not up to code. ...find it, or I mean, if it's, it's obvious, or if they just don't care. Around, no. but I, think it's doing I just fine. found it interesting. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. <laughs> Careful. Jeez. Just pushes right down there. Bye! Any secrets? Any silence? Just um, look at this place. Yep, it's a fan. Oh! Jesus Christ. Oh. I didn't have my hands on the keyboard! I could have been really dead! I could really do with a hamburger right about now. <laughs> Stop being weird. I get it, cause I like meat and I'm turning into a werewolf and I and yeah. Also, I think Laura is becoming my new favorite character. I think she's she's new waifu. And so, 
I'm gonna try and keep her alive oh, to the best of my abilities. But the last two waifus that I tried, they fucking died, so I can't really promise anything at this point. Do you think. What the fuck? A lump of what appears to be damaged or scarred flesh. I thought it was like a heart. Actually, something is in here with us. <laughs> Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Nah, it's just the pizza person. Pizza delivery. A long way down. Shrek! I'm looking down! Well, where's Cave out? <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. I don't mean Someone's to judge, but I feel like Ryan has the most dead sense of humor ever. Well, the mysterious ever. brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? Uh. You know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. Get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, until now. Kill the man eating werewolves. What about yeah. your friend, uh, Caitlin? Is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Yeah, she she has the hots for me. Dylan does too. Oh, modesty, thy name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's just a fact. They're not exactly secretive about it. So what about you? Who do you like more? I don't know. Maybe neither. Damn. No maiden list. This way. I see a light. Yeah. Right, it's just or like. Just I like hang out here. Up to you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> eating their spinach. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? I mean, I feel like I'd be. I ooh, give me, give me. Yeah, but I feel like I'd feel more safer and more in danger with the the wolf lady leading the way. Safer because she could protect me. It's promising. M more danger because she could turn at any moment and kill me. <laughs> you know? It was like... 50-50 shot. Bet it all on black. Get it because she's wearing leather. I think she's wearing leather. I think this is it. It's a door. Uh, beats me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <laughs> yeah, me too. Shall we? I was just about to say, is Laura and Ryan gonna get together? But then I realized Laura already has a boyfriend. <laughs> So that wouldn't really work out. <laughs> there he is, Kate. Kate Lee. Uh, what happened here? Eh, it's complicated. Gosh. I used to think this place was so cozy. This place, really? Yeah, it reminded me of a ski lodge. Sounds cold. Until dawn, <laughs> roughly. about being trapped on a remote ski resort in a snowstorm. The cable car is broken, and you've only got each other for warmth. And when the food runs out, you've <laughs> this is literally an until dawn reference. There's no way it isn't it. right. <laughs> 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 
Because, like, in Until Dawn, spoilers as well to anyone who hasn't seen Until Dawn, you get, you get trapped in a cable car, and you're, like, in a ski lodge, and, like, you gotta survive Until Dawn. So, this has to be right. A ski vacation does sound pretty nice right about now, though, huh? You ever been? Skiing? <laughs> Don't know the first thing about it. Couple trips down the bunny slope, you'll get the hang of it. <laughs> well then, we better get this van up and running then, huh? Silas! Get my QTE fingers ready. <laughs> huh. well, let's see what the damage is. I checked the back. Well, fix or no fix? Okay, so the engine's completely screwed. More great news. I mean, if I could summon a working car out of thin air, I would. Wait, maybe I can. Okay, she's gone nuts. <laughs> Just goes into there's creative mode. Up the road. If we're looking for a vehicle, maybe there's one there. That sounds like a long shot. Motherfucker, it's the only thing we got. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. Dylan? Yeah? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I'm starting to dislike you. Like I care. <laughs> That was the most random ass conversation ever. Just like, alright, Dylan saves himself for his mortal friends. And then she's like, Dylan, you know what? Shut your bitch ass up. Isn't this where Jacob is? What was that? Huh? What was that? <laughs> oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. Playing as Ryan. Keep it down. You keep it down. Shh. Knew there were hills to leave right next. An antiquated rum still, likely from the pro prohibit prohibited whatever. There is a relic of the Hackett's family past. This is an old still. I guess business was booming.
Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrophonic. No. Um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got a screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. Mm. No. God damn. No. No, no. Not my mm. My only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you, what did you do to her? Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? No, Laura knows what she's doing. <laughs> Laura, what have you done? <laughs> eh, calling us not gonna help. <laughs> I'm gonna get her killed. Did you miss me? Mm, Hopefully, really. <laughs> you brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters, only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> But it's no less than she deserves. The wheel of fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle eye can tell where it's going to stop. Details. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness and watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Uh. 
Kills Ma, okay. Look, you still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. Why did you say that like I should actually listen to you? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> What's that supposed to be? <laughs> Have you been there before? Captain. The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. <laughs> What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever? <laughs> yeah. Okay. What was that? Let's just keep moving. So, Ryan and Laura, huh? Oh boy. <laughs> you think they gonna get it? You think they gonna fuck? <laughs> uh. Oh, you're talking about him being a jerk. Oh yeah, that, that, um. <laughs> no. Yeah, he was being kind of a jerk, wasn't he? <laughs> yeah. She did say she had a boyfriend, though. Well, maybe he tuned that part out of her story. <laughs> Probably. Probably thinking about how he can sneak off and be all brooding under a stairway while he works on his abs. What a jerk. What a jerk. <laughs> Not that it matters. Now that he's off on a daring adventure with Little Miss Mysterious, how do you compete with that? Kinda got close at the fire pit back in the day. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? It was always next year, right? Well, let's get through this year first. Hmm. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident and heroic with an eye patch. So pirates. <laughs> Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. Oh shit. Relax, it's a motion sensor. We're okay. We've come okay. in peace to steal one of your oh, look, drunk cars. Ew, come on, this way. Just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Just start blindly firing. Gotcha. You did to my Caitlin. Bitch, I'm overpowering you. I'm young and smart. You're old and can. Everybody stop! Constant. What the fuck is going on up here? Uh, wake up. Wake up. Darling. Wake up. Wake up. Fuck. Oh. She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Wait, that's the voice actor for Carl in Life is Strange, right? No more party. No more. My 
protecting it. Travis. Fuck. <laughs> Everything's going wrong. No, no, leave it in. Just, it's a part of you now. Yeah, I'm not doing that. No. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the way he just hits a little knife in the second. <laughs> Whoa, what was that camera? Lady got her head blown off. Silver, no, I was gonna say silver bullet man. <laughs> Can't read it. Uh, Kayla Hackett's letter of co confession addressed to her grandmother. Can I read it? Or not. Okay. Yeah, just don't let me read the fucking letter. To be honest, I was kind of self-defense. I mean, she was trying to steal the shotgun away from me. And, um... I didn't know if she was trying to kill me, so... I actually had... Ew! Yeah, that's disgusting. I'm just gonna say it was self-defense, even though probably it wasn't. <laughs> Yeah, Ryan, you've seen better days. Yeah, I knew it. I had to just check it out. Um, that's not a good idea. Werewolf. Or not. I thought a werewolf was gonna jump out and be like, boom, motherfucker. Let me just limp my way over to the door. What a... I was about to say, what a bunch of creepy masks, but no, it's just pottery. Oh, shit. Uh, blocking doors aren't gonna do anything. <laughs> oh my! the cabinet on his home
please, could you please leave? What are you doing? You fucking dumbass! He's still there! What are you doing? Oh my god, how dense does this guy have to be? I'm close. Stand by. Over. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna run my ass away with a knife in my side. I can't make it far. Like, there's no way I'm gonna make it far. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker! Yeah. You're a fucker. I mean, you see his muscles? I don't think that little fucking box is gonna do shit. Cabinet, dresser, whatever. Uh, instincts. I'm just gonna jump around. Help! Hi. Yeah, there's a run around the whole house. <laughs> so over here we have the bedroom. Over here we have the uh, the bathroom. And back there we have the kitchen that has werewolves. So what do you think about the place? You thinking of buying it? <laughs> it's kind of a little out of my price range. Plus I'm kind of into, you know, looking for a place that doesn't have many werewolves. I kind of want to play it. I, I kind of. Nice trophy. The spoils of the Hackett's, hunt, ha Hackett's hunting prowess. You think they'd want to cover the bullet wounds and signs of injury? Perhaps they serve as a reminder that these animals are definitely dead. Around here. I mean, yeah, these still these are the woods. So, I mean, other than the man-eating werewolves, I mean, there's still normal wildlife. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Never mind. <laughs> So, about your dead wife, I'm not, I, uh, We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Uh, Try me, motherfucker. Oh! Because of it, I ain't got enough silver to kill you. But I'm sure to hell can make you suffer. Okay. <laughs> I can't have you die! I can't have you die! Get off me, old man, you fucking hillbilly! Yeah, I'll knock your ass out, bitch! Who's gonna win? Uh, dead Carl? <laughs> Alright, oh shit. Never mind. Uh, no, I'm gonna. Oh, 
do it. I don't. Run, bitch! Well, I guess it's a good thing she killed it. <laughs> He's like, wait, do I leave? Jacob, you fucking idiot. I swear to God, if you die after all this. What are you? Nowhere. Hey! Everybody fucking stop right now! Okay. Shoot her. Take her face oh, off. God. You know what she did to Kaylee? And she killed your mother, too. I was defending myself on that part. She was trying to take the back. Wait! Oh, my God. I know I said I fucking hate Ryan, I hope he dies, but I kind of feel bad. You know, you could close the door a little faster. Is that good? Did I do the head? Close it quietly. This seems like a spot of where we would jump out of this. Yo, come on, man. You gotta help me. I do? Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> Please! You stole my knife! Ah, oh, shit. Ah! Oh. 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 <laughs> oh no, you've been bit! Pick on someone your own son. <laughs> Travis! <laughs> No! Oh, oh, easy. Easy. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Seeing better days. Oh, Ryan. Oh, how bad is it? You're gonna I'm die. So sorry. <sighs> That bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how are you? It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. Might 
dying. You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. Bite him. What? Ryan, if you let me bite you. What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected, which means. Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means. Yeah, yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life, and mine, and Max's and your friend's too. Let you bite me and live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> it's your call for now. <laughs> so, are we doing this or no? I kind of want to see Ryan get turned into a werewolf. But. If I don't, there's a chance that someone could see me dying and kind of say, no, that, that also won't work. Because by the time they get here, they have to get back. And... Yeah, fuck it. Do it. Bite me, mommy. I mean, fuck. I mean, Lara. <sighs> nice and tender for you. Oh, on the arm. Oh. I was thinking about on the neck. Yeah, the arm works. Why was I thinking she's a fucking vampire? <laughs> <laughs> Good. Yeah. He should start to feel better soon, I guess. Fuck. We gotta go. He caught it. Listen, if fucking what's my call it? If Ryan gets turned into a werewolf, at least he'll be turned into a werewolf with Laura. That's all I'm gonna say. These guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. Okay, I think that's where we're gonna end up this episode. Um, we blew up an old lady's head, or Ma's head, and um, we battled Carl. 
Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to punch that like button in the face like a pirate. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see you